Hello, my name is Mike Vukovic. I'm the director of high school with Des Moines Public Schools. In this video, I will be explaining the difference between the virtual model and the hybrid models at the high school level. Our first model is the fully virtual model. If you choose the fully virtual model on your registration form, you will not have much change from the current virtual model that you experience. Some of the minor details of change are that you'll be, your student will be enrolled in virtual campus as well as the homeschool. So an example would be if you are a Hoover Husky currently and you choose the fully virtual model, you will stay a Hoover Husky, but part of your enrollment will also be at virtual campus. This allows us to serve your student the same way that they are currently being served which is having access to a teacher online five days a week in both synchronous, which means live, and asynchronous, which is on their own, instruction for five days a week. If you decide to choose the hybrid model, that is different. What you'll experience there is really a two week cycle of one week being three days in person and two days online. And then the next week, being two days in person and three days online. You will be placed in a cohort, uh, either cohort A or co co cohort B, and Wednesdays are the days that alternate for you, as you can see in the schedule. If you decide to take a central campus class, uh, your schedule will stay the same for as much as we can keep that the same, but it, let's say you're in a different cohort and you take two classes at central campus, we may need to move you around at central campus in order to make the, the uh, cohort work. If you take a Central Academy class, nothing will change. Everything will stay online in terms of uh, your instruction that you receive from your Central Academy teachers. A couple things with a hybrid model, we cannot guarantee the class sizes or the social distancing. Uh, we will maintain as small class sizes as we can, but we obviously don't know how many people are going to sign up for virtual, and some of our teachers will have to be teaching fully virtual. So class sizes cannot be guaranteed. Also, social distancing is going to um, be, do, we're gonna give it our best effort um, and do it whenever we can, but we cannot guarantee it. Currently right now, um, you're receiving instruction five days a week. In the hybrid model, there are really two ways that your students can receive that instruction. Obviously when they're in person, they will have the teacher in front of them and they will be teaching as normal. Uh, in some cases, uh, depending on the class and the, the, the teacher, uh, the, the teacher may also live stream their class to uh, the students at home. This doesn't work well in all cases, so it's a case-by-case -case basis. A teacher decision also depending on uh, the classes that they take. An example of that would be a Woods teacher uh, would, would necessarily not uh, have it live streamed due to the fact that they're walking around the room and probably helping people with safety issues and how to cut and using uh, heavy machinery, that model might not work for them. In some cases, you'll also receive uh, instruction in person. And then when you're at home, we'll, we'll engage, your student will engage in asynchronous learning. And asynchronous learning is really where the teacher has set up modules on Canvas and your student will be on their own learning at their own pace, submitting. Uh, uh, their material that way. And then when they come back in person, uh, everything will be uh, discussed and caught back up and reviewed with the teacher when they come to their in-person learning. I hope that helped answer a lot of your questions in regards to the two different models of fully virtual and hybrid uh, instruction at the high school level. There are resources on dmschools.org that you can uh, access at any time. Feel, feel free to give your school a call as well and they have, can answer any of your questions. Thank you again for listening to this presentation and have a great day.